wastewater can be pretty stinky and even corrosive. So here in this lab, we're trying to make our waste less woeful. Hi, I'm Adam from the Advanced Water Management Center at the University of Queensland. And today I'm going to show you just some of the research we do on wastewater systems. When water leaves our homes from sinks or toilets, it enters into the sewage system. This is a series of pipes and pump stations that carry the waste to the sewage plant to be processed. But between leaving our house and reaching the sewage plant, things can get kind of stinky. As the waste breaks down, it turns into different sulfur compounds that microbes and bugs find pretty delicious. As the bugs eat the waste, they turn it into hydrogen sulfide gas. This gas is pretty unpleasant and smells like rotten eggs. So we're using these things here to try and research how our waste systems work. These are fake sewage systems. Basically clear plastic cylinders which we place the wastewater into to study what gases are present and what happens under different conditions. By using these systems called reactors, we are able to test different methods of neutralizing the smelly gas. We do this by placing different chemical compounds in the water for several weeks using a pump system, and then retest the water to see if the smelly sulfide is still present. But smell is not the only thing we have to worry about with hydrogen sulfide. It's also corrosive. This means the cement that supports the wastewater system falls apart and needs to be replaced constantly. So, to study this, we place cement in the reactors with different levels of hydrogen sulfide to see what happens. We also create an atmosphere like a real waste system by controlling the temperature and humidity. This is a piece of concrete that has been exposed to a small amount of hydrogen sulfide. And this is a piece that's been exposed to a lot. The cement becomes soft and foamy, which can cause potential problems like leaks. But luckily, through our testing, we found that oxygen and nitrogen compounds kill the bugs that make hydrogen sulfide. So, by treating the wastewater while it is in the sewers with oxygen and nitrogen compounds, we get rid of the smell and the corrosion. So now we are looking at getting this process used in sewers Australia-wide. But there's still a whole bunch of wastewater research to be done. But for now, it's a little less witty.